Hey party people, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here. My name is Crystal from Rosie's Closet and today I'm going to show you how to run an ad or a sale on Poshmark. Okay, so let's get to it. Uh, you guys can see my desktop now. Um, here I am in canva.com and I also have my Poshmark closet uh, up and ready so I can show you what I'm doing. So uh, in Canva, I'm just looking for a square design because um, all of the photos that you post in Poshmark um, have to be square or it edits it into a square. Uh, so I'm looking for a square design. So any one of these would work. Uh, let's go ahead and do an Instagram post. And then uh, you can use any of these particular templates. There are hundreds of them. You can click on this little um, see all and more, more uh, templates will open up for you. Um, let's go ahead and do something for Valentine's Day. So these love Instagram, or you can search here also if we put in Valentine's. Uh, there, you can see a bunch of different ones that will come up. You can edit these as much or as little as you want. You can leave it exactly the way that it is and maybe just change the text that's in it if you like. Um, sometimes I find ones that I just love the way that it is and I just edit the text. And other ones, um, I'll just completely change the entire thing. Um, so let's go ahead and do, I, don't know, I guess we can pick any random one here. Uh, this is cute. So, okay, so now I have this up and we're going to um, start a sale in our Poshmark closet. So uh, we want to go ahead and change this text and you can change it to anything you like. Um, let's change, get rid of the happy and we'll just change this to Valentine's Day sale. And you can also adjust the size that you want if you want it to go all the way from um, edge to edge or you can um, adjust the size of the text up here. You can also adjust the font if you want a different font. You can click through, look at the different fonts. Uh, you see this little crown over here in the corner? of the font, that means that in order to use this font you need to have a premium or pro um, account um, in order to use this. Uh, if you want to set up a premium or pro account, the link is down below and you can click on that. Um, it is a affiliate link. Um, it's not very expensive. I think it's like 12 bucks a month or something like that uh, for a pro or premium account. Um, if you don't see that little crown next to any of these fonts, then you can use any one you like. Uh, so, you know, you can flip through these different ones, try them out, see what they look like on there until you find one that you like. And we're just going to go with that one for now. And then we can go down here and change this font as well and just type whatever you like. Maybe uh, your conditions of the sale. Uh, let's see, sale runs. Uh, let's see, February, what are the dates? February 8th, so we can start it today. February 8th until February uh, 15th. February 15th, maybe you will also want to put on there um, what's on sale or um, maybe you want to say like 30% off or you know, whatever it is that your sale actually is. All right, so that text is set up the way I like it. And then uh, we want to go ahead and if you'd like, you can change these, um, change the graphic. Just notice this is a little off center. Let's go ahead and change that just a little bit. It's bugging me. <laughs> okay, um, so you can change the graphic if you like. If you don't want to change the graphic, you can also change the colors. Um, so for example, let's just click this blue color. We can change it to black and see how it just changed that. Uh, we can also change, let's see, this red like to a yellow ooh, or a blue. 
Um, I like the red, so we'll go back to the red. Um, but we can change the screen. Oh, look at her hair is green. Um, oops, that doesn't look good. How about um, yellow? Woohoo! It's interesting how they picked uh, his jacket to match her hair. So I guess the green is a good option. We'll leave it green. So it's green and red. Kind of Christmassy, but that's okay. It'll work for our uh, demonstration here. So if you want to add other um, elements, uh, you can choose from photos. They have tons of different photos that you can pick from in here um, to add to your graphic. Or you can go to elements, and you can use different elements in here. We can also search Valentine. And you can add things like a heart. And then again, you can see right here it says free. Um, you can also see there will be ones with a little crown, which means that you need the pro account. Uh, or if you see a dollar symbol right there, it will tell you how much um, that particular graphic costs if you want to, to use it. So for instance, this one says this image can be purchased for only one dollar. Uh, so let's go ahead, we can just add a heart for an example. And we'll just shrink it down a little bit, maybe just put it right there. And um, that's pretty much it. You can add text if you like right here. Uh, you can add music, you can add videos, but you don't really want to do that for a, a Poshmark um, picture or Poshmark sale um, I guess a flyer or sale picture, um, you know, because you wouldn't be able to see the video or the music anyways. Uh, you can upload your own pictures if you want to do that, uh, or your own graphics. Uh, and you can also completely change the background. So you can use just about anything you want. There are so many different backgrounds on here that you can choose from that are a lot of fun. Uh, let's see if we have maybe a heart one. Yeah, there's lots. Something like that's pretty. Um, it's pretty hard to see the 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 font with all this stuff in the background. So we can just leave it as a solid color, like that. And um, that's pretty much it. It's it's really 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 simple. So just go up to uh, this download button at the top. And you click here what you want to do with it. So I'm just going to go ahead and download. Okay. And these are your pro options. If you have that account, you can do a transparent background. Maybe if you wanted to put this on a t-shirt or something, you'd want a transparent background. Or if you wanted to use it as a logo, uh, you'd want transparent. Um, also compressing the file. Um, I don't need to do either of those because we're going to use this graphic just as it is in the Poshmark closet. So we're just going to download it just like this. You can also choose um, different file types. Um, I'm going to save it as a JPEG and we'll go ahead and download it. Easy peasy, done, just like that. Okay, so now I'm going to go over to uh, my Poshmark closet. Welcome to my Poshmark. Okay, so here in my Poshmark, uh, you can see here's my closet. You can see some other um, ones that I've already done in Canva for my Valentine's Day sale and also for uh, a jewelry sale that I have running constantly. So yes, here is my Poshmark closet. If you go to the very top, scroll all the way up to the top, you can click here, sell on Poshmark. Now if you already have a Poshmark account and you're already selling, then you know how to list on Poshmark. So if you click that, it'll pull up uh, this listing template for you. And right here where it says upload photos or drag them in, you can take your Canva design from the bottom of your computer or wherever you may have saved it, and you can drag it right up there. And you can, you know, adjust it however you like, apply it. And then in the title, you just want to type something like uh, Valentine's.
can't spell and think at the same time. Valentine's Day sale. Uh, you know, whatever you want to put there. And then you might want to describe it a little bit, like um, sale runs all week, runs all week, uh, blah, 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 whatever you want. Select a category. It could be anything. Let's go with dresses. Um, none. Select a size. It, again, it can be anything. Um, that's an optional, so I don't fill it out. The brand is optional. Color is optional. I don't fill out any of these things. Required price, I put, or I'm sorry, original price, I put zero. Listing price, I put a ridiculous amount of money so no one will buy it. And then you just go ahead and hit next. And there it is. So it posted, posted it. You can connect all of these different accounts if you'd like, and it will post it across all of them for you. Um, and it could also share it to a party if the uh, category that you picked uh, matches a party that is currently going on. So like for this party, it is a boho. Um, this particular um, this particular sale graphic would probably fit into that boho because we listed it as a dress. So um, they're not very specific unless it's only for specific um, specific brands. So here you you can connect all of these if you want, and then um, and then click to list it, and it'll post it across all of these platforms as well as on your Poshmark. So um, I don't want to list this because I already do have a Valentine's Day sale running. So we'll just go back and cancel it. But I will show you the one that I have listed in my Poshmark closet. So we'll go back. Okay, so you can see there's my Valentine's Day sale and I'll just click on it for you. So you can see how it shows up. So that will be uh, your picture shows up right there. Um, the title, Valentine's Day Sale, that's the dollar amount, uh, the size. This is the category that I put it into. This is my description. Uh, you can answer questions or type something here if you'd like. And this tells uh, your customers exactly what is to be expected. And that's it. Easy peasy. That's super easy, right? I know you guys can do it. It's so easy. Don't worry. Just go in, play around with Canva. It's really, really easy to use. And again, if you need the link, it's down below in the description. It is an affiliate link, so I will get a little kickback uh, if you guys sign up that way. Um, but try it. It's super simple to use, and it's so easy. Then once you post it into your Poshmark account, um, you can share it just like any other listing. Uh, share it to your followers, share it in parties, whatever it is that you'd like to do to, um, to share your sale. You can also post it to Facebook, to Twitter, to Pinterest, all those different platforms um, to share your sale across, across the board. So um, yeah, definitely try it out. Let me know what you guys think. And I will see you guys back here for another Canva tutorial next week. And uh, happy sales to you guys. Thank you so much for being here. If you haven't done so already, please hit the bell on the way out and a thumbs up. Let me know that you enjoy my videos and I will see you next time.